Now the step number five in friction calculation is the we are almost close to the uh, calculating of uh, uh, frictional loss in a pipe uh, valves fittings things like that. Now for the um, uh, straight pipe we have a equation to calculate. However, for a uh, valves uh, fittings like elbows, we have to use something called equivalent length. Uh, length. In this problem, it gives you the uh, four-way directional valve. Just for the for an example, only one valve is added in the system, four-way directional valve. So first thing we need to calculate is called the equivalent length. So the concept is how much. Uh, a, a straight pipe would loss uh, equivalent to that um, so the equivalent loss in a straight pipe um, in comparison to that uh, fittings or uh, valves things like that in this case we got this four way directional for k value is four and then diameter is three inches and then the fiction value we got that from the moody diagram which is 0 0.02 to now I'm going to convert that inches to foot. I know that I want to cancel inches, so I'm going to divide by inches. One foot is 12 inches. So if I calculate this, the equivalent length I have calculated 45.45 feet. Now we're going to use that Darcy's equation to calculate the uh, friction losses. Darcy's equation. So that is the friction loss calculation uh, equation K, sorry, friction factor L by D, V square by 2Z, uh, that's the equation. So if I uh, input all these values, F is 0 0.022 times the total length is uh, the pipe is 120 feet, you can check that above, plus this equivalent length of 45 feet has equivalent loss to a directional valve so and then divide by three inch uh, diameter now this is in feet the denominator is in inches so we have to convert that we'll do that later now the velocity you can check and go back it was calculated 2.27 uh, feet per second and then two times the gravity constant 32.2 feet per second is square now this velocity part is going to be square i have only th this inches uh, that i need to convert so i want to convert that cancel that inches so i'll write 12 inches is one foot here so if i do this calculation i got a very small number about 1.165 feet of water so we are pumping water here so that's the in terms of the water so that's the loss in that 120 feet pipe and the directional valves